Good morning, you guys. Today is Tuesday, and there's not a lot going on today. Um, Mammal's here with us. Gavin is outside watching Penny because she had to go potty. Dawson's taking a nap, and I just finished doing some um, online reviews for this uh, eyeshadow that I'm wearing today. If you want to know what it is, check my other channel because I'm getting ready to film a video about it. Um, but you guys might not see that today or even tomorrow because our internet's out. So that's fun. I've tried to fix it. I don't know what it is. Um, Britt can work on it when it gets home, I hope. Hopefully it'll be back up and running tonight so I can edit, but if not, I'll just have to upload videos when it gets fixed. Bummer. So my son just threw a big wadded up piece of paper at me and said, read it. Look what it says. Can you guys see it? It says, I love you. Oh, I love you too. You're so nice. Okay. Oh, I have to make you one now? Okay, game on. guys I'm going to brave it come out here and show you what I've done to my little privacy deck out here um, I just killed a bees nest and there's a lot of angry bees around me right now but it's all right so I made this little shelf out of old wood that the previous owner left out in a pile in the yard so I'm putting that to get use I just put like some of my old bottles up here in this bottle I just got at the Dollar Tree a while back and this little pineapple that I got at Walmart for 10 cents. Random, it was in the clearance aisle. This little star I got hanging up here. I've had this star forever. I got that when I bought my, or I rented my first apartment. And I made this little shelf. It's really crooked, but that's because for some reason the screw won't go the rest of the way down. But it's cool, it looks rustic and whimsical. So I got some of my old bottles up here. There's a little um, lantern that I got at a yard sale for like a dollar. The rain shouldn't hurt any of this stuff. Um, I put a little mirror out here. It's made out of real wood, so it should be all right. It's got a coat of paint on it. I got some deer antlers up here. My little wind chime this is really cute. This is where the bee's nest was. So there's an angry bee right there. He's mad. I made this little, um, lantern thing out of a mason jar there's a tea light in there I think that'll be really cute at night and of course I got my little son I've had him forever I got him at a flea market and just this little wreath 
and I moved my chairs for my front porch back here and I moved some other chairs up to the front porch because we very rarely sit up there I just thought they looked better out here and now we'll have a table these screws and over here I fixed this board it was popping up because the guy that lived here before us thought he was a handyman but he really wasn't and he used these little bitty screws to screw down these boards so they started breaking like this one so I went ahead and fixed that it was really bugging me it's been bugging me for a couple months now so now I have that fixed and I'm gonna find some more stuff to do with all this wood I have a ton this is just a little portion of what I got um, but every year right around this time when I start really looking forward to fall I start feeling very Pinteresty and DIYE. So I need some ideas on what to do with those. I'm thinking about painting some sayings on them, maybe stenciling, uh, maybe going and buying some wall decals. I don't know. We'll just have to. We'll just have to see. And this door right here really needs painted. I'm not sure what color I'm going to paint it, but it's bad. This is where um, the guy that lived here before us, his dog, he had a Rottweiler, and he uh, would scratch here so I need to paint that but I think it's coming along it looks pretty cute I really really want to string some lights up here going back and forth but that's just not really in my budget right now I'm trying to do everything with what I've got for now but how cute would that be to have some of those ball lights str strung like I don't know like 10 or 12 times across the top of there and it wouldn't be a problem because I have this outlet here and I have a switch there because the guy that lived here before had a hot tub right here this is where it was plugged in so I have that too I really do want at some point in my life to have a hot tub but um, they're expensive and it's a lot to maintain and I have heard that they um, make your electricity bill more expensive and that's just not what we need right now um, I have been looking into the um, inflatable hot tubs that's something that I'm kind of leaning towards but I just have to save the money up for it it's hot out there you guys it's hot. so I just finished editing yesterday's vlog <sighs> I'm so happy the internet is back on. Uh, I had to mess with it a little bit. I actually took the internet cable out of a splitter and put it directly into the wall and that seemed to do, to do the trick. And then I had to call um, Xfinity and have them send a signal and then it worked. So that's good. But my tablet uh, has a little bit of internet problems. It just shut it off and it's charging right now and now, it's, and now it can't go back on. Well, if you just let it charge for a while and be patient, I'm sure it will work. I love you. So Gavin has a football practice tonight. Hopefully Britt will be off work in time to take him himself so I don't have to get everybody out and drop him off at practice. Um, if I haven't mentioned it before, Britt is coaching Gavin's football team. So... Worst comes to worst, I just take Gavin there. We all sit in the car and wait till Britt gets there, and then Britt stays with him the rest of the time. So, yeah, I feel pretty productive today. My porch is looking good, I'm happy with it. I've got this video edited and uploading or rendering. I'm thinking about filming a video for my Sit with Britt channel today. Um, I'm thinking about filming a what's in my purse video or just like a chit chat video. You're going outside? Okay, stay in the yard. Okay, promise? Bye guys! Gavin's going out to play. Love you! No, stay in our yard, okay? It's so awesome having a kid that is mature beyond his years. 
And I'm not bragging, like, I'm really not. I'm just... I'm just appreciating him being the kid that he is. I can trust him to go outside and stay in the yard and be good. You know, when I was his age, you couldn't trust me to be outside by myself. I'd run away or I'd throw rocks at cars or climb a tree too high. and I wasn't as responsible at six years old as he is. Except for the fact that he's riding his bike right now with Crocs on. That doesn't seem like the best idea. Bye. Dustin's saying bye. Bye, brother. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to make for dinner tonight. I have no freaking idea. No idea. So here we are. This is my little setup. For those of you that are watching right now in real time, this is like inception to you. But yeah, here's my, I got my phone plugged in right there. I got my phone on a tripod with my new phone holder. Cool. All right guys, it's about time for bed. I just ended my live stream. I had so much fun. That is so much fun. I'm going to start doing it more often. Now that I have my little porch set up out there, I like it. I like it a lot. Maybe next time Britt can join me. He was in here playing video games while I did that. Gavin is still up for some reason. He's supposed to be brushing his teeth and getting ready for bed. I'm going to edit. Get this video up for you guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below so you can keep up with all of our videos. And we'll see you next time. Bye. I'm holding on, if almost gone.